Hello everyone, and welcome back to Pikmin 2. In the last episode, we went to the Valley of Repose and did almost everything. Today, I plan to at least try to finish it. Will I? I don't know. But there's at least one treasure here we're missing. And I have an idea where it might be. If it's not there, then I'm just gonna go ahead and leave it. I want one Pikmin so I can just kind of have Louie get back by using the uh, sleep command, because I'm just checking this out. So, uh, it's where Louie landed. Why is this... There we go, now the Wii remote's working. Kinda. Uh, I might need to readjust the thing a sec. Huh, no. I thought I checked over here. Anyway, because I currently have no idea where this thing could be, because we checked over the... There, could it be there? We'll have to check. I'm going to grab 20 of each Pikmin except 19 blues because I already have a blue. Partially just so we can hear the unique music that plays. But also, I have no idea what I'm going to be facing, so... Just in case. And while I'm waiting, I might as well do some gathering. Because I want Louis one picking to get back. So I'm just gonna just kinda gather stuff. I think Louis back now. Yep. In that case, let's go ahead and get as many of these Pikmin back to flowers, because some of them are specifically the purples, let's see. That should be good, and we still have a nectar left over as well. So now that everyone's together, it's kind of time to just run around the map, I guess. I really don't know what else to do to find stuff. Because we got the other scrap, and I'm guessing the only thing I can think of is that there's something up there. I'm gonna be keeping an eye on this thing over here too, just because, uh. Do you respawn? Doesn't seem like it. Just wanted to be safe. Why are there? Alright, once the parables catch up, we can go on. I really don't want any Pikmin to fall into the water. Blues are probably fine to do that, but still. Right, let's... We got everything over the here, right? I mean, you're still here, but... Wait. Oh, okay, it's one yellow. Right, let's go ahead and grab Olimar, because we can. Grabbing people distance. Oh yeah, the meter's going up. There you are, you need yellows. No, actually, hold on. Looks like I can climb up a hill here to see. I do need yellows, though. I'm gonna need more. Looks like I need 25 yellows, so... Go take us to the onion so we can drop off some Pikmin, because this is the fastest way I can think to get back. Actually, let's have Louie wake up, because I still feel to throw some Pikmin. And then I'll just fall asleep in the middle of the whites. Right, Olimar put the reds and white up, and let's get some more yellows out. Actually, I need to wait for you to go into the onions first. There we go. 
And while I'm here, I might as well as just kind of break these down. I'm not looking at what color they are. And there's no way I'm bringing them back yet. Looks like we got white Pikmin and maybe a blue Pikmin there. Nah, just white. Wait, no, I wanted to pick the old Pikmin out of the onion. And now I have to wait longer. At least I have all the Pikmin I need now. So now let's, I guess we just walk back. You know, I should've just left one of the captains up there. Anyway, I'll be faster if I don't have to wait for them, so I'm just gonna toss them up here. Oh, wait. Hold on. Can they... Right then, I guess I'm taking them with me. Because these guys are too slow. They're just slide... Not they're too slow. They slide down. Which, to be fair, is the exact mechanic we're using to actually get this treasure. But it's still kind of annoying that I have to do it this way. Anyway, I should be fine to cross the bridge now. And it's not too far away... So, we'll be fine. Probably. Wait, no! Uh, blues, 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 blues. Okay, we're fine. You made it. Why did you walk into the water like that? Now I just need to wait for the elves to get here, and... There we go. And there it goes. Now I just gotta have to wait for it to get back to the base. So I wanna check if there's anything nearby I could grab. Because if I'm correct, that is the final treasure that we have to grab. So did you, did you respawn? No. Neither are any of the enemies over here. So the only thing really left I can do is gather the pellets? Which really isn't that helpful. I get like a couple Pikmin from- actually, let's go this way because I think it's going to be safer. I get like a couple of pellets from it, so I might end this day early and go on to another day. Because that way we can actually do stuff. Yeah, they're all good. Oh, and these boats happen to be red, so... And seeing as this is falling down, speed it up, please. I think there's still nectar up to there. Yeah, so I, I I might as well use the nectar. In a second, at least. Anyway, we got the fosterized Ursa. You know, this oddly looks like. That's the Grizzco Bear from Splatoon! It looks exactly like it except for the wooden base and no radio. If that is a reference to this, that is neat. Also, it might just be a common bear statue, so... Yeah. Either one works. Uh, you know what? Go fast, please, because I want to try something. So I want to put all of my Pikmin up, except reds. Because I'm going to be just taking all the reds out. Uh, no, I saw a couple more yells in the party. I'm going to be trying to get as many red flowers that as possible. Now I want purples. Yeah, there we go. Oh, and I actually kind of just did that on accident as well. That's fine. Am I missing a Pikmin somewhere? It doesn't look like it. Yeah, I have 100 Pikmin in the party. And I am just going to be feeding all of them a single piece of nectar. Because why not? Oh, and there are also some flowers. Go! Feed! Become big and fast! 
Yeah, that seems good. Not all of them are flowers, but we should never need this many flowers. So for now, let's go to sunset and start a new day, I guess. All 100 reds going to one onion, and I'm just gonna kinda skip the cutscene. Today's report, we got one item and built up our numbers a bit. The fossilizer is a thing. Uh, sure. Today I tried building a small room at the top of a tree. It reminded me of my younger days when I lived in a little shed. Those memories make this bearable. You know, I just realized we're almost done with the main story of getting a thousand Pocos. And we're not going to be able to see all of his story. We only have 500 more to go. If not, I go to the Awakening Woods or Perplexing Pool. Let's go to the Awakening Woods first, because I know of quite a few things I can grab here. Oh, hey, we lost some reds here as well. First off, Louie, just kind of grab these. And I'm going to put them up instantly. Here's something. Oh. Oh! Sheer grubs. Uh, you know what? Just take a hundred blues out for now. I want to just get rid of the sheer grubs. Ah, uh, sure. I'm getting these blues later. Uh, yeah, so sheer grubs can take progress back on this. So just kind of toss a bunch of blues over here, and that is starting to lag the game out. Wait, we're actually losing a couple. Uh... Oh, well, at least they get to build the numbers back up with the Sheer Grub Corpse. Spectral Lids. Sure, get those to flowers. And I'll get the yellow pellet to them as well. That's just nectar. First thing, can I grab a blue out of here before that happens? Yes! First thing I'm doing is just kind of getting rid of the, this wall. I didn't need 100 blues, but I didn't really know what the shade rubs to break that, so... Yeah. Oh, so it looks like that's a plate or a bowl keeping the water in. And now that that's complete, let's actually organize our Pikmin numbers a bit. I need to put most of these blues up. And... Yeah, so while that's happening, go back to working on this, please. Because I do want that wall broken down. As for the rest, I'll just grab 20 of each. As I normally do, actually. No, I want purples. That should do it. Hopefully, yeah, 80 Pikmin and then there's 20 on this gate, so... Break down faster because I have purples and reds now. Please, uh... There we go, one more. And... Come on, there we go. So there's an electric gate up there, that's the main thing I was checking for because I didn't know what we had to deal with. Let's go ahead and have the yellow start working on that. And you can see a cave over there, that's the main reason I'm doing this. 
Ooh. I'm gonna have Louie go over here, and I want to put up all other picking types for red. This might- this will make sense in a minute. I just don't want to use purples for what I'm about to do. Because they're kind of valuable, and I figure I'm gonna lose a few here. I kind of wish the, that all Pikmin could go into the ship at once, just with the purples and whites. And you know what, while we're here, I'm gonna take this out as well. Well, do we have to, uh... Hold on, is that a 10 pellet? Is that a 10 pellet, though? It is. Hold on, are there three ten pellets here? There is! Okay, that is good to know. As well as spectralids. Uh, first off, bloom. Because I like it when Pikmin bloom. Uh, I'll be getting those before I go into any caves, I know that for sure. And sure, why not? Grab that. Is that another 10 pellet? Or. Oh no, that's just a spice berry plant. And the 20 yellow pellet. Wow. That is good to know that they, those spawn there. I mean, how's this gate doing? Uh, we're doing fine. I could go get a couple more yellows on that, but for now I just want to use the reds for stuff. Well, that's a big boost to our yellows. Open, there's only one. I can hear. I can hear the gate breaking down. Oh, there's a spectral in the water. But I need to be careful because I'm pretty sure an enemy can spawn here. Oh, okay. Come on. Okay, we're losing some picking here, which is unfortunate. But I guess it's the best I can do. Yeah, I'm losing some reds to the water, but I don't know what else I can do about it for now. Yeah, that's... I only lost 10, or plus a couple are drowning. It could be much worse. Uh, let's put it like that. I, I'm not... I don't approve of this, but it could be worse. Yep, figured that would happen. Oh, come on, you try going through the water, why? And just one. Oh no, uh... I should have brought blues with me for this. Yeah, that's my bad, but we have plenty of reds, so we're fine. Plus, we're going to be building up quite a few more with this. I'll go this way. I think it's going to be faster to go this way, plus I get to confirm something I'm not sure about. And there's that treasure up there I'm going to need to grab as well. So if I'm correct... Uh... No, I am wrong. I thought they'd be burning snaggots up here. Intriguing. My acoustic sensors are picking up a high-pitched whale. It seems to emanate from the area near this gigantic stump. This large root must penetrate deep beneath the planet's surface. Fascinating. Yeah, I thought they'd be burning snaggots here, but I guess that's just me being... Remembering, remembering Pikmin 1. Yeah, I know you're there. I'm just gonna ignore you. Right, so I don't have to pull any more Pikmin out of the ground. I'm grabbing this. And let's grab these. Right, Olimar, this also broke down. So what do we have here in this cave? 
Probably something weak to electricity. So you have at last reached the higher ground. Congratulations are in order. Wait, what's this? My seismic sensors are picking up tremors deep below. What force is at work in the depths of this planet? So let's do this game first and closer. We just need fire and electric pigments. So blue and yellow. That's simple enough. Uh, not wait. Did I say blue and yellow? I meant red and yellow. Anyways, for now, let's put like that many up and trade them out for blues. Just in case. Because I want to grab these pellets. Wait, this one changes colors. Oh, and it's a 20 pellet. And it coincidentally went to the blues. This one doesn't change color. There we go. I'll put a couple more reds up just so I can grab blues. And give me the blues real quick. Yeah, 25 will be enough for this. I just need to throw them all up here. Might as well. Anyway, that should get those good and grown. I'm not gonna worry about the reds up there because they will basically just return to the onion after I go underground. That should hopefully be fine. Uh, oh, <laughs> that made a take a shortcut as well. I wanna back up because I want them to be able to grab that pellet by themselves. Yep, there we go. So for now, let's just put all of our Pikmin up and so I can get ready for what I'm about to do. Actually, I'll probably just go for 20 of each Pikmin type now that I'm thinking about it. Which means, well, not all Pikmin types, but... Let's go off this, basically. No, I want purples. Not any more than 10. And how many do I got? Uh, let's grab five more reds and five more yellows, then we should be fine. Yep, this is looking good. 70 Pikmin going in, and if there's any Boldmen, I have 30 Pikmin spare. Oh, I guess there is more than just Boldmen, but yeah. Anyway, let's... Well, you know what, if I just run up here, as long as the Pikmin are in my party, they should go in. So, 70 Pikmin. We're good! I could technically bring one more Pikmin if I didn't want to go grab those reds either.